Hi there, welcome back to my channel. This is Kelly Schaffner. I'm so glad that you joined me. I wore this dress for you today to show you what I found in my closet. It is a uh, kind of a transitional dress with the big floral print. So I found this in my closet. I've had this for a couple years. Maybe it's because it's a lighter color than what I've been receiving in my sub boxes. So I did want to show you that I do own a great big floral print. I like this dress a lot and I thought I would film in it for you today. So thank you so much for joining me. If you haven't done so already, please hit subscribe. Please join me again for all my unboxings. I unbox a lot of different subscription boxes and some apparel boxes that are not subscriptions and that's what I'm doing for you today. I am doing today another M.M. LaFleur. I have ordered a bento box and a stylist at M.M. LaFleur has put this box together for me based upon a style quiz, some questions that I answered about my style and um, my price preferences. This company is based out of New York and they specialize in women's workwear and I wear a uniform to work but I still like to try on their clothes and so I've ordered another bento box. Let's get right into this. So the box is beautiful. I, uh, we have a couple of pieces you saw. This feels like a belt. It's wrapped up in canvas and this is a brown leather belt by M.M. LaFleur. So that looks very nice and it looks like we have a jewelry piece. Um, is that a necklace? Can you see that? Let's see if we can take it right out of the box. Oh no, it's a, this looks like a bracelet. So maybe if I turn it to the other side, you'll be able to see it better. I like that a lot. It's uh, very fine, but kind of different in shape and something that I don't have anything like that. So that's very interesting. The clothing all comes wrapped in a great big plastic bag. So let's unwrap this clothing and see what's inside. We have a nice bundle. It looks like I got another jardigan. I sure liked the jardigan last time. I thought it was a little bit small. It's all wrapped in a nice bow, which slipped right off. And I'll link my other, my first M.M. LaFleur video so you can see the try on I did. This is the jardigan. <gasps> And it has a button! I'm so happy! They actually read my feedback on the last package and this hopefully has my name on it. It uh, looks a little bit larger with a button closure. So I'm very excited about this jardigan. I'm impressed by their jardigan. You can look at their collection online, the M.M. LaFleur collection. Um, this is a dress. This is the, does it say which dress this is? I can read that when I, um, it's got some pockets, some draping in the front, a little knot. Um, this is in a color that they sent me last time, but I did ask them to send dresses this time. This looks lovely. I'm excited about this dress. Oh, more color, more color. Um, and another dress. This is a green dress. Uh, very simple. Um, it's got, looks like it's got kind of a cap sleeve, which I'm not real nuts about, but I'm excited to try that on. We have another burgundy dress with a very, uh, this is a kind of a flesh colored, very thin leather belt. This is, looks like a three quarter sleeve and a burgundy um, dress. It does have pockets on the sides. This whole bento box looks so lovely. I can't wait to try everything on for you. This is the first dress that I unboxed and now that I have it on, I like it even more. Uh, let me show you the detail in the front of this dress. It has that draping look that goes to a knot and it looks like a wrap here and the wrap is finished. The inside is 
beautiful silk-like fabric so when you walk it uh, it looks very finished inside it does have deep pockets on both sides that are very functional but it doesn't seem to take away from the silhouette at all I like everything about this dress my husband helped me to zip it up and he really likes this dress as well oh I'm so glad that I tried M.M. LaFleur's dresses. What do you think about this dress? Now, what Irish girl isn't going to love this dress? I uh, like this dress surprisingly more than I thought I would. I think these are not at all cap sleeves. Um, I'll tell you, my husband doesn't care for the sleeves at all. He thinks this dress looks very uniform-like, but I really like it. Let me stand back and show you. This, uh, Dress is not belted. I put the belt on so you could check out this really cool belt. Um, and I'll take it off so you can see the silhouette. So this is just a really plain dress with a high neckline, um, but I'm really enjoying it. Now let me show you this belt, how it works. It, I couldn't figure it out at first, so you put it in this way and through here and attach so i think that's really nice and i think uh, if you want a more defined waistline i but i actually prefer this dress just like this what do you think just in time for saint patrick's day so you know that i haven't read the stylist note yet so i'm not sure if this is a jardigan or if this is a blazer but it resembles the jardigan quite a bit. It's made out of the same fabric uh, of the jardigan that they sent last month, but it has this single button closure there, and this also has pockets, very functional pockets, but this is a really ni nice knit blend, and I'm, I'm liking everything about this. I think it could be worn with dresses, but I would probably get a lot of wear um, wearing it with slacks and jeans. Let me show you the third dress that they sent. This is, uh, again, I don't know the names of these dresses, and I'll share that with you and leave that information in the description. This is the three-quarter length dress with the leather belt. And if you notice, there are some uh, spots to hold the, the belt in place, so it won't be falling down. I like that. I really like this belt. There's some really shallow pockets here. So for you girls that like pockets, this dress has got them. Let me stand back and show you the length of this dress. I like this dress. And the bracelet. It has an extender on it so you can wear it at, at different lengths. And this is kind of a fun bracelet. All right. I. Uh, Looked through the prices and I'm glad I did before I started filming because it was really hard for me to tell which dress was which so I had to go and check the tags um, and, and that has everything to do with the colors and the, the way they uh, titled these dresses. That first dress that I tried on was called the Taylor 2.0 dress and the color is Deep Indigo. Um, that dress is $265 and I think that dress is lovely. The second dress I tried on in green is called the Sarah 7.0 dress. That The color is called, not green, it is called Vividian. Isn't that fancy? That dress is $195. I like that dress a lot. My husband's not crazy about the dress, so I'm not going to be getting it, but I like that dress. The third dress I tried on was the Etsuko, and the color is Claret. That dress is $195. This uh, bracelet that I'm wearing that I think is so fun and lightweight is the Galatea bracelet and the color is brass. It sure looks gold to me, but this bracelet is $195 and I won't be keeping it. It feels very, very lightweight. I think that's the reason that I like it, but it doesn't feel very substantial and uh, nothing about it uh, says $195 to me. The square belt in black, I thought it was brown, in black is $80. I love that belt. I don't have anything like it, so that belt will probably be mine. And you can see what I'm wearing. 
And anytime I'm wearing an item of clothing for this wrap up, it usually means I am strongly considering buying it. This is not the Jardigan. This is the Gibson 2.0 Blazer in black. It is $225. I think this is a piece that will stay in my closet till the day I die. It's such a versatile, uh, classic, timeless piece. I think it's worth every bit of $225. I am so pleased that they read my feedback and they created a box that I think I like this box a lot more than my last bento box. Before you leave, make sure that you leave a comment and let me know what you think about the pieces that I, that I received. Let me know if you would ever get a bento box and if any of those dresses are something that you would purchase. Everyone needs a blazer like this, at least I do. But please leave your comments before you leave. If you would, are interested in getting a bento box or trying M.M. Lafleur, I will leave all of the information in the description box below. It's really great company to work with. The customer service has been great. Everything about it, I just can't give it high enough praises. I want to thank you so much for joining me once again to unbox uh, some great clothing. Uh, if you haven't hit subscribe yet, please do. I don't want you to miss any of these unboxings and it's always nice to have you here with me. Thank you so much for watching. God bless you.